Weekend is almost here. So exciting. And there are a lot of fun things to do here in Southern California. Michael Giuliano, editor at Time Out Los Angeles, is back with us for some of his top picks. These are free. Most of them, I think. First one's not. The first one's the, not, but a lot, lot of, the of them are. <laughs> uh, welcome back. So tell us about this first one, Cinespia. Yeah, we'll, we'll get the one that involves cash out of the way. Yeah, uh, well, it's okay to pay a little cash once in a while for a great event. I think this one's worth it, too. Yeah. So Cinespia, people may be familiar with, um, they stage these screenings at Hollywood Forever Cemetery every summer. Yes. They're not back in the cemetery quite yet, but they have some off-site events that have kind of the same vibe. So it kicks off tonight at LA State Historic Park uh, with screening of Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring. So, you know, get comfy, <laughs> have a comfortable <laughs> chair and a blanket. Um, what makes these really fun, though, is that, you know, you'll find, you can picnic, right? They, unlike the cemetery, you can't bring your own booze, but they will have a full bar. Um, but they have a DJ before the screening. They have these really amazing photo booths for each uh, screening. And then you'll find a bunch of others past this weekend, too. More at LA State Historic Park with movies like Mrs. Doubtfire. And um, then next month, there's a Always couple. Always a classic. Yep. And then next month, there's a couple outside the Greek theater, too. You can watch um, the SpongeBob movie if oh, you want. Oh, I love it. Griffith Park. Um, yeah, and so they have screenings for the next two months right now. Okay, perfect. The Beverly Hills Art Show is back. Tell us about that. So this happens twice a year. Uh, this is the spring edition of this. Some massive, massive art fair in Beverly Gardens Park. Um, people might know this better as just the very, like, fancy green space that runs along Santa Monica uh -huh. Boulevard in Beverly <laughs> Where Hills. people take their pictures. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so, you know, it's four blocks, something like 325 different art vendors that are set up. Um, you can go and buy if you have the, the pocketbook for it, or you can just peruse. Either way, it's free to get in on Saturday and Sunday. There's a wine and beer garden. Um, just lots of fun stuff to see. Go spend some money. Uh, tell <laughs> us about Off the 405. Sounds intriguing. Yeah, what this, is is, it? this is a great uh, free concert series at the Getty that they have on select Saturday, or select mostly Saturdays in the summer. So it kicks off this Saturday uh, with a Bay Area musician named Spelling. Uh, and there's a DJ set before that as well. Now, this is a little bit of like an early warning kind of thing because I think it might have just sold out, but you like, there's you gotta know. Next time. Yes, no, so this is the <laughs> thing, right? Is they, very important, like write this down, three weeks, that's what you wanna know. Three weeks before the event is when they release tickets and they're totally free, but like you wanna snatch them up because it's a great free event. You know, the museum is open until eight, so you can oh, go nice. see exhibits beforehand, yeah. watch the sunset from the Getty, which is always amazing. Um, and also the later you go, the cheaper parking is, which is always a plus. A good tip, that's why we love you. <laughs> Have a great weekend. Um, and that is it for us right now. Thank you so much for being here. For more information on all the events we talked about, check out our website, kcalnews.com, and click Scene on TV. Jamie. I can't wait to check a bunch of those out. Thank you. He's always playing my weekend for me, Michael. Thank you.